How to use FaceTime and AI Beauty in Honor phones. Open your gallery. Then open an image that you want to edit. Tap on AI edit icon in the middle. And from here go to FaceTime. FaceTime feature is actually just for opening an eye in an image. Tapping on the eye open icon will begin the process. In about 10 seconds, you'll see the result. There you go. Image is updated with an open eye flawlessly. You can tap this icon on the right to compare the original against the edited photo. But there is a big disclaimer here for the FaceTime eye open feature. The feature will only work if you have other photos of the same person within your gallery that has its eye open, like this one. The AI feature used the open-eyed photo as a reference for the eyes. So if we are going to delete this open-eyed photo, then try again the AI edit, FaceTime, and eye open. This will not work anymore, since the AI cannot find an open-eyed image reference. Just something to keep in mind. Now, related to enhancing the face, going back to the AI edit. You will see here AI beauty. There's a lot of options here, but something that I want to highlight is the blemishes. Adjusting the scroll bar below will magically remove all the blemishes in the subject's face, while keeping all the facial features intact. A really effortless and effective way to smoothen the face photo. There's a lot of other features here if want to go editing crazy. Like thin face which removes chubby cheeks. Use deaf lash if there is an overexposure in the photo. Enhance eyes makes the eyes proportional and adds vibrance to it. Dark circles is also a good one as it removes the eye bugs and dark spots in the skin, which makes the subject look a lot younger. There's also whitened teeth here, which you know, whitens the teeth if it's visible in the photo. I highly discourage using tone and smooth ear, as it makes the photo overexposed and artificial looking. You'll either look like a wax figure or a cartoon if you use this too much. But, the easiest way to use the AI beauty is just to use the instant icon here. There you go. Just one tap and the photo instantly look a lot better. The AI combines all the enhancement it thinks the photo needs. And it works really well. Now you know.